Hello friends, uh, I am preparing this video for diploma students, basically for the students who are studying in first year diploma engineering and I am going to deal with this subject English. The subject code is 22101. As far as this subject is concerned, it having 150 marks when we observe the marking scheme or the evaluation scheme for this subject it carries 150 marks 70 marks are assigned for your theory examination then there is 30 marks 20 marks for class test and 10 marks for micro project another 50 marks are given for your practical 25 marks for your manual or the practicals we can say which you are going to perform and 25 marks for the end semester examination which will be based on your practicals which you will perform in that particular semester. Now uh, before going to deal with or before going to start our session I want to introduce myself, myself Professor Adinathuma. I having 14 years of experience uh, in the field of education and I am dealing with subject English since, since 14 years. Recently I am working in JSPM group that is Bhurabhai Savan Polytechnic Vaguli and I am preparing these uh, videos for students who are studying in diploma. Let's see, uh, as we have seen uh, the marking scheme of this subject, now we should know what will be the syllabus that is as far as uh, this subject is concerned. The book or the syllabus uh, having five units. The first unit is applied grammar. Second unit is comprehension. Third unit is paragraph or dialogue writing. Fourth unit is vocabulary building. And fifth unit is regarding speeches. So, uh, as far as these units are concerned, my dear friends, uh, let's see. The very first unit that is applied grammar, when we see the topics in that particular unit, the topics are that uh, what we can say lessons which are given for study. The first lesson is article. As far as this lesson is concerned, it is very basic thing which we studied or which we learned up to 10th standard also. So uh, let's see how to use articles. Firstly, we should know uh, what are what are the articles. As far as the articles are concerned, these are some words, or we can say these are some frequent words used before noun or the noun phrases. So, um, as far as articles are concerned, there are two types of articles. The first is indefinite articles and second is definite article. As far as indefinite articles or the definite articles are concerned, firstly we should know where we can use articles. We can use article before singular countable nouns before singular countable nouns firstly what is singular singular as we know that what is singular and what is countable let's see countable means what the thing which can be counted huh? that is called as countable noun and so that we can use article before singular countable noun huh? When, where, when we, we can use articles, that is, we can use articles before singular countable noun. So, firstly, uh, we will see the indefinite articles. There are two indefinite articles in English language, that is A and AND. Let's see, 
why these articles are called as indefinite articles because these articles can be used before that is general things so it is called as indefinite articles so there are two indefinite articles in english language namely a and an so let's see where we can use article a or an we can use article a or an let's see first we will see article a that is we can use article a before singular countable noun beginning with consonant sound so firstly we have already seen that what is a countable noun hai na so the nouns which can be counted is called as countable noun for example a pen hai na we can count pen or pencil whatever may be that the things which can be counted uh, that things can be called as the countable hai na so that we can use article before countable noun now we are dealing with article a that we can use it before singular countable noun beginning with consonant sound so we cleared that what is singular and what is consonant sorry what is uh, singular and what is countable noun now we will see uh, what is consonant as far as uh, the consonants are concerned if we have to understand the consonant firstly we should know which are the vowels hai na with the reference of vowels we can understand the article uh, we can understand the consonants let's see in english language there are five vowels that is a i o u a e i o u hai na these are the five vowels first one a second is e i o u these are the five consonants so sorry these are five vowels so before this if we see this vowels that this five are vowels so other that uh, what we can say the letters all the alphabets in english language can be called as the consonants hai na just a e i o u this five are vowels and other alphabets in english language in a b c d we can say these are the consonant sound so we can use article a before singular count, countable noun beginning with consonant sound now which are the consonant sound just see beginning with consonant sound firstly we should understand consonant sound as we have seen that the a e i o u we have to accept a e i o u hai na the other alphabets in a b c d we can say these are the consonant sound let's see p is the consonant sound b that is b hai na is the consonant b b is pronounced as a b hai na so it is consonant sound let's see uh, before uh, a bell hai na a bell b is uh, when we pronounce bell b is a consonant sound so before a bell we can use article a in this manner before consonant sound means the uh, as far as the articles are concerned uh, the pronunciation also plays a vital role over there how we pronounce the word when uh, as we have seen the very first rule that we can use article a before singular countable noun beginning with consonant sound hai na like this so um, the same is, same thing is uh, about the uh, article an we can use article before singular countable noun before that beginning with vowel sound hai na so which are the vowel sound like a e i o u these are the vowel sound so before this vowel sounds we can use article an so here also the pronunciation plays a vital role where we can use article a or an hai na that we can use article an before word umbrella hai na o when we pronounce umbrella there is vowel o is there hai na so we can use article an over there likewise there are various example uh, uh, we can see regarding article a and article an so this is about uh uh that is indefinite articles a and an okay do you understand uh, let's see uh next
I I hope that you will understand this and I will go further for definite article. So the next article is uh, next type of article is definite article. Why this uh, article is called as definite? The, there is only one article. The is called as definite article. Why this the is called as definite article? The simple thing is that the is called as definite article because article the is always used before specific things. So we can use uh, we can call we can say that the article the is a in the uh, sorry definite article. So uh, as we have seen the use of or the assays of article a and an now we have to see how we can use article the uh, in various sentences uh, there are some rules the thing which are already referred before that we can use article the over that the book that you gave me yesterday is damaged hai na we having the reference of that particular book previously so we can use article the over there then before various things like uh, before the names of ocean we can use article the before the names of newspaper we can use article the then uh, before the names of countries we can use article the the uh, another rule is that before unique things before unique things we can use article the like the sky it is the unique thing so we can use article the over there so these are some uses of article the over there so this is about definite article and indefinite articles again i am uh, revising the same thing that we can use article a before the singular countable noun beginning with consonant sound we can use article an before singular countable noun beginning with the vowel sound and there are various rules which we gone through where we can use article the so my dear friends up to now we have seen where we can use article uh, that is definite article and indefinite articles now where articles cannot be used means omission of article and uh, there are also some rules for omission uh, where article should not be used so the first rule is that before the names of substances which are the abstract nouns or the uncountable noun as we have seen it previously that we can use article before only countable nouns so let's see before abstract nouns before the names of substances the nouns which cannot be counted or the uncountable nouns we cannot use articles so the first rule for omission is that before the names of substances abstracts and uncountable nouns we cannot use article for example platinum is costly metal platinum is costly metal it is the abstract noun which cannot which is not countable we can say so we can use we cannot use article over there then before plural countable nouns which are used in general sense let's see before plural countable nouns which are used in general sense for example students study to achieve success students study to achieve success it is the plural countable noun which is used in general sense so it is not necessary to use article over there hai na before proper nouns also uh, it is not necessary to use article proper nouns like raj and yash are good friends raj and yash are good friends so it, these are the proper nouns so there is no need or necessity to use articles of a there okay these are some rules hai na before the languages also it is not necessary to uh, use articles for example we speak marathi with my family member so article cannot be used before the name of a language hai na likewise there are various rules hai na so this is about articles uh, so dear friend this is about the article so uh, if you like this uh, video please subscribe and share my video thank you very much the link will be provided uh, to you for the for the sake of revision 
some questions will be given uh, will be given uh, the on the topic of article you have to solve this thank you very much